All right, uh, hi everyone. Uh, I go by Peer. Uh, I'm gonna be going through the menus of this avatar and the features it has, and uh, we'll just go through the basics, such as go locomotion. You can just fake place with yourself if you don't have that. Reset, put yourself in poses. The classic e-boy pose and whatnot. Oh yeah, also uh, you can do scaling as well, so you can scale an avatar. And uh, once you select your scale, um, it says to re reload your avatar. So what you do is you go back, go to OSC, uh, disable, and then re-enable. And now you can see my hands are no longer like scrunched up this way and whatnot. And this also works for the full body. And uh, yep, and then I will just put myself back to the height I was at. That's all there for you. And then uh, the gimmicks on the this avatar I put on here is a wireframe box, a mirror, and an anti poop. And we start with the mirror first uh so you can show up in a mirror only so as you can see i don't show up in a mirror anymore or you, you be a, just a vampire just don't show up in the mirror and then uh obviously go back to normal and then uh, we have uh, uh, the wireframe box which you or anybody else can uh which you or your friends can just grab or anything like that. So once that's done, and then we have a anti boop contact system I put on here, and I brought my friend. It's mainly for those who don't like physical contact. So if my friend who tries to poke me, I poof. Just a basic, you know, disappearing thing, and usually avoids phantom sense. I would say since you can't actually see what's happening to you unless your imagination is that strong then uh it doesn't do anything and then uh, this avatar comes with a lot of uh color changes such as the white sweater a white jacket swap it around and uh you can just you you swift the uh, you shift this Blue eyes, and then uh, finally the hair as well. Hair has a huge shift as well, and then uh, just a different skin tone change as well. And then uh, we we have the sword uh, that uses the VR Labs uh, sword slash. So gotta give credit where the credits due. So you you need to enable the slash effect to do the slash. So oh. so you can do makes different sounds every time you slash. And then uh, if you have both the slash effect and the heavy, then it does a heavy sl slash and uh, if you don't want the slash at all just for RP sake you can just have it off and you can just have the sword and then uh, we have GP particles and uh, I'm just gonna go over the basic controls I believe rock and roll is to just reset hands open is to just Attract and whatnot. Point is push. And then if you do fist, uh, fist or something like that, it starts condensing. And then uh, I did make a system with this as well. And uh, which, uh, if you have your friend here and you want them to play with it, you have them hold out their hands. And they have to do a uh, fist. Once you do fist, you press share, and uh, 
once that's done, they basically grab it and now they have control over it. And they, they mo have three states as you, which is push, condensing, and whatnot. So that's pretty neat. And uh, you can also change the size. You can make it pixie dust or not. And obviously a little bit of strength control as well. And as always, once they're done, you know, using it, you just uncheck uh, the share and it will just absorb back into you. And uh, yeah, that'll be pretty much it for this avatar. And uh, if there's anything you want to ask or have questions about this avatar, uh, I left my Discord in the description. All right, see you.